My name's Luke. Luke? I've lived here for 17 years. Right here on the corner house? Oh, no, uh, in Buckrow. Oh, in Buckrow. Okay. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> all right. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, I love it here. I don't know. Yeah. Uh, it's great. Had, did you know that there used to be two beaches no, here? I didn't. No. Was that was that like part of the segregation? Yeah, that, yeah, it was. Well, it was. Not, I'm glad it's just one big beach now. Yeah. Yeah, I think everybody was glad there's one yeah. big beach. I don't know. I, they, it looks nice. Mm -hmm. and I'm glad. I, um, they were out there, I guess, signing petitions because they were trying to sell like this half of the beach to uh, this big corporate. They were gonna make it like Grand View. Hold on, hold on. Come closer. Well, this was this was uh this was like relatively you know this is present. They were actually we just signed every everybody that I knew that was 18. I got them to sign it because uh, they were gonna sell all of this right here and uh um, sell it to like a big corporation. They were gonna turn it into like Grandview. If if you, they were gonna build big houses and they were gonna take away some of the beach. And I love the beach. So. Is this private property? Um, I'm guessing it is. Um. And Sam, they he lives right there, and they uh, they have a band. System failed, so ah. we just plug it, plug yeah, it. Yeah. <laughs> just kind of hang out. So you said that um, they, you said they, some developers wanted to buy the property. No, actually, they um, the uh, I guess I don't know the council, city council, something like that, wanted to sell it to the developers. Oh, but because it's city owned, the Buckrow city owned. The Buckrow Beach. Yeah, Buckrow Beach. Is the somewhere. entire beach. Yeah. Oh. Okay. So. And they wanted to make it like Grandview, yeah. which is just private. Yeah, private. And so people would like the big houses, and so that would leave us with nothing. You know. Right. And that's right. Not, that's not cool. No. Should share. Yeah, everybody should share. <laughs> okay. And you said that. Hold on again. Tell me again what your full name is. Uh, Luke Clinton. Luke Tyler Clinton. Luke Tyler. 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 Clendenin. Clendenin. Okay. And you live here? I live in, yeah, I live right over there near First Street. Ah, uh, okay. And how have you like living in Buckrow? Um, I love it. It's my home. Like, I got it tattooed on my heart, actually. Wow. Yeah. Buckrow. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I love it, too. Yeah. Because this is the only beach that we had right here. Well, my grandpa we grew up here, and my great-grandpa grew up here, and we just... I don't know. I love it here. Mm -hmm. I never, you know, mm -hmm. I, I've always wanted to go to different places, but I, I always come back. Yeah. Know? But um, like I was saying about the petition, uh, the city council wanted to sell, I guess, part of Buckrow to, uh, to I guess, some developers to build. They wanted to build like ho big hotels, private hotels, and big private houses, and make most of the beach private. You know, and I, that's taken away from, I guess everyday people like us because you know we like the beach too mm -hmm. and we just you know we go out there and skimboard and hang out skinboard what's that skimboard um board about this big it's like two by four kind of oval and you like when the when the waves wash up on the sand you throw it and you ride it okay i have seen those yeah. <laughs> so you said that how many people needed to sign the petition to um, stop it I think we got, I, I had like 200 of my friends, but I know everybody in Buckrow, so. Mm -hmm. Like I said, I was born and raised here. Mm -hmm. Buckrow born, Buckrow bred. <laughs> right. But um, they, uh, they, they actually did, the petition passed, and they're not going to sell it. That's good. Thankfully. That's I'm happy great. about it. I'm glad there are people like you in the world who are active and work on things that yeah, you believe in. Yeah, I mean, in. I've always wanted to give back to the community, so, I mean, and I'll, I'm not 18, so I couldn't sign the petition myself, but... I did get my, I gathered up the troops, you know, and got them to sign it. But I think it's great that you're out here, you know, filming this for your family. Yeah. That's, that's really nice. Yeah, and, you know, my great-grandmother came here in the 1920, late 20s from what? Richmond, and she started a fish fry with her cousin on Bayshore Beach. And it was a big happening right spot. Here. Yeah, they even had trains that came through. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Never heard of it? No, I've never, never. I'm sorry, I've, I've never heard of that, but that's great information. Though. Yeah, and part of the reason why I'm actually coming down here to record is because I tried to go online to find information, and there wasn't yeah, any. Yeah, there's not. There, uh, yeah. I mean, like I said, I've never heard of it. Yeah. You know? But, yeah. you know, I thank, thank you. Thank you for uh, letting me be on your video. <laughs> thank Hi. you. Bye. <laughs>